Tesla's at it again. The company is now offering its new Powerwall 3 battery for direct purchase by homeowners via the Tesla website. What does this mean for potential system owners and solar installers? I'm gonna be answering that question and talking all about Tesla Powerwall 3 in today's video. All right, so in today's video, we're talking about the new Tesla Powerwall 3 Direct program. Now, technically, Powerwall Direct is nothing new. Uh, Tesla rolled out this program as well with the previous generation Powerwall 2. Uh, and essentially what this does is it allows consumers to purchase the batteries directly from Tesla's website. Not necessarily having to purchase the installation service, the full installation service from Tesla, but being able to purchase the batteries directly and then work with a contractor or an electrician of their choice to finish out the installation. Now, in the past, I've talked to many Tesla solar installers that hated this particular deal. Because oftentimes what happens is if a, a homeowner goes out and requests battery installation quotes from local solar contractors, and then they go onto the Tesla website to compare pricing, oftentimes the pricing that Tesla was offering for direct purchase was undercutting what its installation partners could offer. And so many, many installers hated installing batteries for that reason, but they felt that they had to offer batteries because they knew that that was the trend, that was the way the industry was moving, was it was no longer a solar only environment, but particularly in places like California and Texas that are losing or, or have already lost one for one net metering, we're now going into more of a solar coupled with battery storage being the norm. And so they wanna be able to be profitable both on the solar panel installation and on the battery installation. And that was very hard in the past when Tesla was undercutting you for the install cost. But what we're hearing now is that Tesla is now offering much better margins for its installation partners. And it really is about time because as I've said in previous videos, you know, Tesla's had sort of a love-hate relationship with its, its installers because although they are so-called partners, in many cases, Tesla finds itself directly competing for sales with contractors. So maybe the contractor had to spend money on its own marketing and advertising to get a homeowner lead to actually engage and, and request a solar quote. And then that same homeowner might go directly to Tesla's website to request a quote directly. So now that Tesla has provided for more margin for its installers, what I'm hearing is that more and more installers are liking offering the Powerwall 3 battery. By the way, uh, if you're under contract to have a Tesla battery installed, or maybe you've already had a Tesla Powerwall battery installed, whether the Powerwall two or the Powerwall three, uh, leave a comment down below. We'd like to hear from you and what your experience has been. Did you choose to go direct with Tesla or work with a local contractor? Now, there's some other reasons why the contractors like the new Tesla Powerwall three battery as well. And I think it really all boils down to speed and efficiency and profitability of the installation. Just a quick word from our sponsor, Revolt. If you're looking for an all-in-one pre-assembled solar and energy storage system, then you need to take a look at the new Revolt Home Power Plant. The Revolt Home Power Plant is a complete solar and battery system incorporating an outdoor rated enclosure, solar inverter, battery storage, climate control, AC and DC disconnects, and a full 200 amp AC load center. The system is pre-built and factory integrated, so you can keep on-site work to a minimum. With Revolt, you'll never have to build another battery shed. So if you're serious about taking your solar and storage installations to the next level, then you can visit the Revolt website where you can customize your system and place your first order right away. You see, the new Tesla Powerwall 3 battery actually integrates the solar inverter and the battery inverter and the battery storage cells all into a single appliance. So whereas in the past you may have three, three or four different boxes to install and then have to run conduits and connectors between them, now pretty much the Powerwall 3 battery is everything you need in terms of your solar balance of system. So you have your solar panels on the roof, and for most installs, a single Tesla Powerwall 3 battery is sufficient, so you can just run your solar PV circuits from the roof directly down to the battery, and then from the battery to your interconnection point, which is where you're gonna deliver power to your electrical panel or deliver power to the electric grid. So it has significantly reduced the installation time and complexity because again, all these components are now factory integrated inside one appliance, which has also reduced the chance of installer error. 
right? Every time you have to make an interconnection between manufacturer's components, there is a small chance that the installer does improper wiring. Maybe they didn't tighten the conductor down tight enough and the connection overheated, or maybe they mismatched some wire somewhere and caused an equipment failure or caused damage to the equipment. So by factory integrating these components together, they have minimized the chance of installer error. Now, of course, the trade-off to that is that now you have one potential central point of failure for the entire solar system and the entire battery system. So in theory, this new architecture is better for solar installers if the equipment works. And I guess time will tell and we'll continue to follow this to see what kind of track record does Powerwall 3 have six months down the road, a year, two years down the road in terms of reliability. Now, by the way, none of this really matters if you pair your battery with the wrong solar panels. So if you're looking at different solar panel or solar system options for your home, if you haven't already seen it, go back and watch our previous video on the top five best solar panels for 2024. Now, of course, if you're a homeowner, if you're in the process of looking at different solar panel and battery storage options for your home, uh, if you need to get a price quote for a local installation, or maybe if you already have a quote and you need to get a comparison quote to make sure that you're getting the best equipment or getting the best deal, uh, as always, feel free to reach out to us on the link below there. You can set up a call with a solar expert uh, or just use our free online quote tool to see how much solar and storage costs in your area. So this has been a discussion on Tesla Powerwall 3 Direct. Uh, folks, as always, if you're getting good value from the videos that you watch here on Solar Surge, make sure you give us a thumbs up uh, and go ahead and subscribe to the channel as well if you haven't done so already. That way, as we have new announcements like this coming out, it'll come up on your homepage and on your feed so you can stay up to date with us. Well, that pretty much wraps it up for today's video. I thank you all for spending some more time on the Solar Surge channel. And as always, I'm Joe Ordia here, encouraging you to get prepared and be empowered. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.